Uh, hi, this is just going to be a quick uh, Photoshop tutorial uh, showing you how to achieve the 3D effect which um, I've got on the screen in front of you right now. Um, so I've just got that in full screen to show you the final product. Um, right, let's have a look. Um, here we've got the original photo. Um, this technique uh, works much better if you use a black and white and generally a, a black and white image with quite high, high contrast like this image here. Okay. Right, so the first step is to create a duplicate of uh, your original photo. So I'm going to create a du duplicate layer. I'm going to name that layer red. Um, next step is to click on the blending options for that layer. So I'm right mouse button clicking on the layer and going blending options. Now see here we've got advanced blending and there's channels. You want to turn off the green and the blue channel and just leave on the red, uh, the red channel. And go OK. Now we want to make another duplicate of the red layer. So right mouse button and duplicate layer. And on this layer here, same thing again. Blending options, right mouse button, blending options. And this time I'm going to turn the red off and turn the green and the blue on. And this layer can be renamed Sign. Cool. Okay, so we've got our, our image, we've got our two layers, we've got the blending options set. Now we just need to click on the red layer and click on the move tool up in the toolbar. So the very top tool on your toolbar. And with the move tool selected, you're just going to click the keyboard to the right. Um, now this will vary depending on you know, the resolution of your image, but for this image here, around six or seven times, I can see I've got a nice sort of red fringe starting to show there. And you can click the cyan layer and sort of nudge it back a little bit. And uh, there's your final image. Just put that into full screen by pressing the F key on my keyboard. Okay, thanks for listening. Um, be sure to subscribe to my channel if you want to um, hear more creative tutorials like this.